Well, the country's deputy prime minister also bashing the Free National Movement leader over criticism of the Bahama handover ceremony and his absence from the House of Assembly when the details of the project were presented. In a statement, Davis indicated that Dr. Hubert Minnis has left another chair empty in the halls of Parliament and his latest no-show is a clear indication that he is avoiding all possibility of being exposed is unable to defend his misstatements on matters of national importance. According to Mr. Davis, the Prime Minister told parliamentarians that an important milestone has been realized with the handover, which will ensure adequate preparation for the smooth opening of the world-class resort come next month. He said if Dr. Minnis had come to Parliament, he would have been asked to pay attention to facts regarding the employment of thousands of Bahamians and the impact on the economy. He also questioned how Dr. Minnis could be against the creation of the thousands of jobs so badly needed by so many families. Meantime, FNM leader branded the handover as a photo opportunity, but he said the FNM welcomes the additional rooms and attractions, but questions the wisdom of premature opening without advertisement.